We continue to follow a developing story this evening. Strong words from Houston's police chief for the person or persons responsible for shooting and killing a baby boy yesterday. Little Messiah was killed by that gunfire yesterday, and now the Houston Police Department is looking for the gunman. Channel 2's Robert Arnold joins us live from the Southwest Houston uh, Department Complex where that shooting happened. Robert, Chief Acevedo, very fired up about this one, isn't he? Absolutely. The murder of this beautiful little boy has so rattled this community. The police chief himself is out here walking the neighborhood with his officers and the mayor is getting briefed on the investigation while he's on a trade mission in Israel. As for the people who live in these complexes, they're scared and they plan to voice their concerns tonight at a community meeting. I heard the shots like four or five shots. He didn't give his name, but says he was in the parking lot of the Knob Hill complex when a trio of men opened fire on a father and his 10 month old son. And he was just trying to teach his baby how to walk and they just started shooting. Messiah Justice Marshall was killed. His father ran to a nearby Valero to call for help. Police do not yet have a motive. You don't take the life of a 10 month old child. Chief Art Acevedo didn't mince words. That the Houston Police Department will not rest until we bring three cowards into custody. Police have been out patrolling the complex and surrounding neighborhoods. For example, police say these men were detained on unrelated charges, but will still be questioned to see if they know anything about the shooting. Armed security guards also now stand post at the entrances. Maybe they're going to keep doing that. I don't blame them if they do. None of this, though, has eased the fears of those who are used to walking these tree-lined streets. After this, I don't feel safe. I feel like I need to wash my back. And there's Cheat Art Acevedo right there talking with one of his officers. He's been going door to door as the officers have been out trying to get any information they can. They could hopefully narrow down who the suspects are in this shooting. Meanwhile, that community meeting is going to be at 7 o'clock. Reporting live from Southwest Houston, Robert Arnold, KPRC, Channel 2 News.